guys, what's up? So I just wanted to make a quick intro for this video since it's going to be a new series on my channel and um, it's basically going to be once a month and the reason for it is because not only do I not enjoy watching favorites videos, I don't enjoy making them and I don't really think that I have a great audience for them. So instead I'm going to be doing a get ready with me for insert month here. <laughs> so like today's video will be a get ready with me March edition. You'll get to see not only the products that I've been loving that month and the outfits that I've been loving for that month, but also just how I use them. I think I it's just going to be a much more interesting video and a lot more fun to make and to watch. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. So makeup first, after I apply my primer and lip balm, I like to get really close to the mirror and see what's going on with my face that day. Today I need a little bit of extra moisture, so I applied my Cetaphil moisturizer. And now I am using my uh, Glamouflage concealer from Hard Candy to conceal any redness in my face or any particularly blemish-filled areas that I have. And then I use my Maybelline Dark Circle Eraser, and it's basically just a salmon-colored under eye concealer and now I'm using my Dr. Jart's Waterfuse BB Cream and a little angled brush and this just adds a really beautiful glow to my face. I absolutely love this product. It just gives me just enough coverage and evens out my skin tone really nicely. So totally love this. I always use it. Now on to eyes. So I'm starting off with priming them with my uh, primer potion from Urban Decay. And now I'm going in with my favorite eye product. It's the Maybelline Color Tattoo and Bad to the Bronze. I've been wearing this constantly just oh it's totally beautiful I could make a whole video just on that to be honest and now I'm using my the rocket mascara by Maybelline it gives me awesome lashes I totally love it next up I'm using my makeup forever HD powder to set my under eyes and anywhere else in my face where I tend to get a little bit more oily and that really does the trick for me I've been using that for years for my brows, I'm using my Kat Von D eyeshadow palette in Ludwig. It really does the trick for my brows. And then I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. blush and bronzer duo to contour my cheeks. For blush, I've been loving the um, cream eyeshadow from Drew Barrymore's makeup line, Flower, and it's in Mum's The Word, and I've been using it on my cheeks. It's really wonderful. And now for a highlighter, I'm using Benefit's What's Up, and then blending that all in with a big buffing brush. So after touching up my blush a little bit, I go in with Revlon's Just Bit and Kissable Balm Stain, and this is in Crush. I have been absolutely in love with this color and this product, and then I finish it off by setting my makeup with the Urban Decay Do Me Setting Spray. Now it's time to get out of my pajamas, so of course I'm going to put on my high-rise jeans from Urban Outfitters. I am totally in love with these. They are so, so cute, and I wear them pretty much every day. And for my shirt, I'm wearing this tank top from Abercrombie with a nice lace detail, and this cardigan, which you guys know I am obsessed with from Abercrombie. And just to add a little bit more spring to my look, I'm going to wear this mint-colored belt. And I actually got this from Target. Sammy found it for me. I was like, you have to get this. And I was like, oh my gosh, it has these little skulls on it which I just think are the cutest thing ever it's like soft and hard in one belt I'm totally in love another thing I could not get enough of in March was this beanie it's by Neff and I've had it for years but I just recently started wearing it again and it's so cute and it totally matches the belt so I thought it went really well with this outfit I've had a whole lot of bad hair days and this hat really does the trick so for my feet, I'm going to put on my white Converse. You guys know that I love these shoes. I'm always wearing them. And I also like to roll up my jeans a little bit. I think there's something really beachy and summery just to show off a little bit of ankle. So totally been loving that. I roll up all of my jeans. Now that it is a little bit warmer out, I can go back to my favorite perfume of all time, which is Pink Sugar by Aquafina. It's just the most wonderful spring and summer scent. I cannot recommend it enough. It smells like cotton candy and happiness. <laughs> and for accessories, I'm going to sport this necklace that my aunt brought home for me from her trip to Costa Rica, I believe, and I just think it's the prettiest thing in the world. And that is it for this video, so make sure that you tweet me or comment what your favorites are from this month. And if you like this video, let me know because I would love to make more of them if you did. Be kind to another. Bye, guys.